Okay, I'm just going to turn the snaps on. Just make it easier. And create a box. Okay. Now, I'm going to move this pivot point. As you can see, it's at zero on all axes at the minute. It's going to move it out the way move it away from the center of the box and now if I try to rotate this box it will rotate around that pivot point which is you know you may want that but usually not um, so we need to align the pivot point to the center of the box this will make placing the objects into game engines like Unreal easier so center it, make sure everything's set to zero. Uh, now when you rotate it, it should rotate around the center of the box, which is the majority of the time what you want. Um, so now I'm just gonna export this, ready to be put into an engine like Unreal. And that's that. Okay, there'll be times when you don't want the pivot point at the center of an object, for example, a door. So having a pivot point at the center of the door, um, when it comes to rotating it, it's not going to work the way you want it to. Um, for this example here, it's at the center. Now if I was to rotate this, that's not how a door opens. So that's not what you want. What you have to do is realign the edge of the door, which is basically the pivot point, to the world zero coordinates. And then you want to move the pivot point from the object to the zero place on all axis like that. And then just make sure that's all zero out there now when it comes to rotating it it will rotate the way you would expect the door to rotate and this is ready to be imported into an engine so i'm going to export selected and uh, name this door and then save that Okay, so I've opened Unreal 4. Just going to import me models in. And then I'm going to bring them into the game world. And as you can see when you highlight them, where the pivot points are. So with the box that's rotating in the center. And then for the door, that should rotate from the side. In a future tutorial I'll be going through how to make a blueprint door in the Unreal Engine 4 and you'll see why it's important for the correct placement of the pivot point 